I'm kind of just sick of all Shut of up. it, but you debating it with the Minifans. What the fuck is you. going on? Why is he talking so slow? <laughs> Play that sentence again. What is wrong with him? Cancellation culture. This is I'm kind of just sick of all of it, but you debating it with the Minifans. That's where the juice is. Now. Yeah, it so sounds like no. it. It sounds like it. I'm kind of just sick of all of it, but you... I, Steve, I, stop. I, I, did you slow it down or no? I didn't. No. What the fuck is going on? Does it say, say please clap at the end or no? <laughs> Like, I, I, don't, I, fuck, I don't give a fuck about Nick Cannon. He's an idiot. He can right. say whatever he wants. It, it, any black, I, I don't care. But, you know, also, like, my ancestors weren't slaves. Right. So I can, you know, th th there is that difference. So, you know, I don't know. But, 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 but you, know, you, know, you know who handles this topic better? <laughs> Kevin Clancy. What's your take now with your ongoing cancellation war? Yeah, listen, I think that debate. from the time, from the beginning of time, if you do dumb shit and get you get fired for it, I don't think that that's like a new novel concept. I understand. Uh, I, I think where the where where Kirk and the Minute fans go crazy is that they've made it this they've made it into something it's not. There are examples of people who get unfairly fired or treated based on. Uh, can I just stop this opinion, real quick? But like, like, like can I stop real quick? Do we really get that into like cancel? Am I missing where we get into this every like? This guy shouldn't be canceled. That guy shouldn't. Be. I don't feel like we actually do a hell hell of a lot of it. I mean, cancel culture assumes a more narrow category. We're yeah, more I mean, talking I mean, about we, like free speech and cultural issues. But even then, it's kind of like uh, I don't think we're giving a million examples every day. We've done a lot more the last two or three months because of what's going on. I guess, but like also, uh, I suppose I don't. I mean, there I were a few know. months where we didn't do it at all because there were just weren't stories about it. But what, I think when it's topical, we talk. Who's about been it. canceled lately though that we've talked about? Well, the museum curator. Right, but we did that, two minutes on that yesterday. Yeah, K. Marco. Yeah, I mean, yeah, we weren't actually, I mean, you know. No, I know. Um, I, you know, I mean, was Kevin complain when I was saying he shouldn't be canceled? Well, I, Dave? <laughs> yeah, right, we've defended those guys. I mean, That's fuck? pretty much been the big story, I guess. <laughs> I mean, you know, God. You guys were saying that Drew Brees got canceled? Drew Brees didn't get canceled. Yeah, Drew Brees didn't get canceled. Drew Brees Did I say got, Drew was, Brees got canceled? I was, this was uh, news to me. Did we say that? No, I'm, well, I mean, it was a, the hashtag was like Drew Brees is over or something. Oh, like I mean, I will say, uh, I saw Jerry tweet this yesterday. More uh, retired or, or current professional athletes tweeted their support of Nick Cannon than they did of Drew Brees. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, without a doubt. I mean, they deleted it right away, Dwayne Wade, and then fucking, like, you know. Which I saw that. I was like, that's what I always say. If you're going to do it, do it. You know, like, then you delete it after two seconds. Well, why? I it's didn't know what it was about. I'm sorry. Yeah. I mean, you, you feel that way. Now you don't feel that way? Like, what I've happened? I have done that, though, where I'll tweet about something immediately, and I'm like, oof, that's, that's what I said? All right. So maybe that is genuine. That was the time-traveling hacker. Like, that's true. <laughs> P. It Diddy was in, like, the news after. for a little bit, and then that was it. And I think Kirk tried to say that, like, Drew Brees was canceled because he can no longer speak his mind. I mean, that's not canceling. So, I, I mean, I guess I'm more engaged in a, in a semantics debate, but I think I when you're like canceled, you're engaged in a fucking debate with yourself in your fucking no, apartment. I, I think so much more measured on this show than he does on Twitter. <laughs> I think what it is is he sees like Kirky Walnuts or Kirk's Burner no tweets or something. Oh, and it's like, oh, this is the Minifans. This is all of the Minifans. Because he's he's like not wrong. Like our, my point is, and we've said this, like, great. Like Drew Brees, you're correct. Can we'll play football and collect his salary. The next time he has any opinion at all, he's not gonna fucking say it. Right. That's and whether you think that's a big deal or not, it's a different argument. That's if you don't because think it's a big deal, it's not a big deal. I'm just saying. And then the whatever, 27 year old quarterback or the 30, you know, whoever, whoever the next person, they're gonna say, you know what, I I'm gonna sit out of this one. And and maybe that's better, maybe that's worse. I don't know, but that's reality. And whether you want to call that cancel culture, if there's a better term for that, use it. I don't care. But well, that's what we're talking about. I think what KFC misses is that cancel culture isn't the act of canceling or some guy getting fired. It's also what people do to avoid being canceled. Like the element of fear in the room when they're filming the rundown, the little Jeb Bush right. feel you have where they're like, eh, we don't want to say the wrong thing. Like Drew B's not speaking out the next time that he you know, has an opinion. That is also cancel culture. It's a cultural thing. Yeah, you can feel in that podcast I did with Coley Mick the other day. You could tell they were yeah. both like, what the fuck are you talking about? It's a culture where you're afraid of getting canceled constantly. Like you're just afraid to give your opinion. Even, even if you might not, you're just afraid of it. Yeah, I guess. I, yeah, I mean, but you want to give it a different name? Give it, I don't I care, but whatever it is, is what it is. Intimidation, fear. I don't know. Keep, 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 no, keep, keep, keep skip on do you at ideas, least, Do you at least see from their perspective, like the Murchison thing was full on 
that's cancellation culture yeah. so, at the most. So like someone if, trying to ruin someone's life. If if Kirk stuck to those examples, I would get it. But every anybody one who's second, been fired, do you guys have a pen? Do you have a pen? I need to they, I need to uh, make sure the rules for for KFC's cancel culture. Well, Kevin's message is you should talk about Murchison more. <laughs> you're right. You know you're right. There's a cancel culture. But if you stuck to that, okay, if anybody who's been fired or anybody who's even been like somebody told they tried to say that Kanye was canceled. Stop. Did I say that? I have no idea what the fuck he's talking about. I don't even what know what he means. I said earlier, he's just arguing against straw men or something. Jamel Hill actually account. said that, I believe. <laughs> did she? Okay. Yeah. I mean, I've never said that. For what? Why? Why? What happened? What did he do? Kanye West. Maybe when know. he supported Trump, maybe? Is that no, the part I, I mean, I don't even, Kanye West is so out of, like, on a different planet. I don't even care. How would you even cancel Kanye? You can't, but, you can't why, but why would you? But I don't even, when have I advocated for that? Ever. You have not. Ever. I don't even know how that idea came us. to reside I mean, like, in KFC's head. It's funny, though. Jamel Hill tweeted, in response to you a couple weeks ago, Jamel Hill tweeted, the only two people I've ever wanted canceled are Kanye West and R. Kelly. Oh, really? So Kanye West is in that category, apparently. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank you, Jamel. Kanye's uncancelable. Kanye Cancel didn't get canceled. No, they, 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 they went too Edgy far Kevin. with it. Like, there are absolutely <laughs> examples of people who like, lose their job. This is like, really uh, did they... It's almost like they leave them in a room for 24 hours and then make sure they stay awake and then say go. There's not a lot of life here. <laughs> I told you. They, you know, Jesus. Who's the third person on the show? Roan. Roan. Oh, okay. I haven't heard of speaking. Well, I think has energy. And there are right, examples of oh, companies yeah. who are bowing down to pressure when they shouldn't, but not everyone who does something stupid and gets fired for it is being unfairly canceled. I, I, I agree. There's, There's consequences for your debate. Hold on. Hold on. Is this on C-SPAN 2 or 3? <laughs> I always get these confused. What Is, is this Barstool Sports? What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> but I get so the core of the core of Kevin's argument. He agrees with us. Thank is, you, Kevin. No, 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 no. The core oh. of Kevin's argument is that we should have said that when <laughs> KFC said that shit about Colin Kaepernick, we should have said, well, I guess you should probably fire him. It's yes. A it's, a <laughs> it's, a it's a business. He said I something wrong. Not saying that. He said something wrong. I mean, you should probably get rid of him. All right. Fire KFC. <laughs> Hashtag fire KFC. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, like, I don't, I don't even like, it's just. But then he's, but then he's like, you know, like Murchison or a specific example. It happens. Like it definitely happens. But I'm just saying it doesn't happen. <laughs> just, I don't think. Like, what the fuck are these minifans the talking? Like, like I think Steve's actually right. His biggest issue is with like, you know, whoever fucking, uh, you know, Kirk's desk or yeah. Mike's pe. I, I, I don't even fucking talking about. He's a, it's weird because he's actually directing his anger at all of social media, but he's saying it's the minifan. Like, I get kind of get what he's saying where people overreact too much. On Twitter, in general, right. But he's saying it's like just the Mina fans. Well, but do they have an opinion on Nick Cannon? Yes, they do. Like cancellation culture. I'm kind of just sick of all of it. But you hey, stop. If you really, did you slow this down, Steve? Or no? With the Mina fans. Hold on. It, it, this does sound like when they remember when they play this like half speed. Yeah, it sounds it like it you're sounds drunk. like is Dan drunk or on drugs or something? <laughs> What's going on? Like what the fuck is going on here? What time did they record this? It was like four in the morning. Where do they record it? Like, what? what is, they sound like they're just, what's going on? They might have been dipping into the 3 chi. Uh, but maybe. Let's, who can blame them? Like 3chi.com slash uh, believe. I'm kind of just sick of all so, of it, but you debating it with the Minifans. That's what the fuck what is going on? Why is he talking so slow? <laughs> Play that sentence again. What is wrong with him? Cancellation culture. What's so, I'm kind of just sick of all of it, but you debating it. With the Minifans, fans, that's where the juice is. Now. Yeah, it sounds like it. Sounds like it. Sounds like it. And you know, man, it's just uh, one thing uh, after another. I mean, it's, did, we're spinning he, around. On was, he in big a, blue was he in a car accident? Like, <laughs> he, he sounds like he's like has d d damage or something. What is going on? Just, you know, it's like, just it's it's just it's you go hmm. and then you go there and you, you don't even think about the fact that like like I'm f I'm forty now. And it feels like two minutes ago I was eight. So like two minutes from now I'll be seventy-two. Is it go that? It's not that busy, fast? man. It's is not it that busy. Does it go that fast, man? It's just like, and then you know, like you think like some guy, you know, uh, misses an exit on the highway and he's gonna go to the next one. The car hits him and kills him, man. It's just like there's no. It's a butterfly effect, you know. Imagine dealing with maps, man. <laughs> like you had to you used to have to pull out a map. Now it's just like in our pockets. <laughs> You know, there was a time where there was just like three networks, and that was it. There was ABC, NBC, and CBS, and then there was cable. But now the, it's like there's all these options. <laughs> it's crazy. What is money? Like, what money is just paper. I can make money right now. Give me paper. You guys still have too much energy. <laughs> you ever 
Do you ever pretend that your fingers are kids and you give them names and you just watch them grow and then one of them wants to go away? Little Pinky. I call him Paul. Paul doesn't want to be part of the family anymore. I don't know why. What if, like, our dreams were real and this was a dream? You know what I'm saying, man? You ever wonder, like, you know, like when you... <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck is going on with this, guys? I'm kind of just sick of all of this. What you, I, Steve? I, it's not. I, I, did you slow it down or no? I didn't. No. What the fuck is going on? Does this say, does it say please clap at the end or no? <laughs> like cancellation culture. I'm kind of just sick of all of it. But you debating it with the minifans that's where the juice is now sure it's timeless you <laughs> sure, just, it, it's just like <laughs> warring factions that will go it, on it, for it, all it'll, time it'll never it's stop okay, well, like, yeah, you know what Ron is like hey can we fucking <laughs> stop what the hell is going on Ron let's get some energy Ron is literally here. like yeah I'm ripping off my fucking shirt and I'm dancing for you guys you want some titties here they are let's go let's go guys let's go if y'all want to talk about it don't talk about it I mean Jesus God like cancellation culture I'm kind of just sick of all of it, but you debating it with the minifans, that's where the juice is. Sure. <laughs> and it's, it's just like, I mean, like, like now? Like, Kevin's gonna be like, yo, Kevin, we'll okay, she's gonna fucking talk about it. We sounded fine. Yeah. The fuck are yeah. What the fuck are they talking about? Other people, I think, would tire of it or be like, I'm not gonna engage in oh, this. No. And you're like, uh uh uh, I have time. Well, that's the, yeah, and, and the minifans, uh, they think that, I think a lot of other people. Slow this back down, Ron. Hey, Ron, slow your roll. Stop me. <laughs> that, that, doesn't, that does not even oh, there you go. A little bit of light into there. the camera. In the, I mean, they are not even on the register. They're not even on the radar, dude. So you got real uh, enemies. I, I am interested to see how they handle it, though, because like, are, are they going to defend the cannon? I doubt it. Did they? Defend oh it? yeah. He, he, <laughs> he he is saying things that you know he should be able to say under their in their mind. But all of a sudden now we're talking about white people and Jewish people. So are they going to be defending him? We'll I sure out. am. I would say that <laughs> what does he mean by that? What is that supposed to mean? Means you're a fucking racist. No what the fuck is he talking about? <laughs> I love how he says it. The, the Minifans aren't even on the radar, but for the 11th consecutive <laughs> rundown, I will allow them to take over my fucking brain and my Twitter account. Oh, you own your own Twitter, you shithead. What does he mean by white people? That we're racist or something? Yeah, when the tables are turned. It's because I of my. Know. I have no is idea. Is it because of my white skin, Kevin? Is that I what you, you're so. skin guy? Is that yeah, what you're talking about or no? Yeah, it's your white skin. <laughs> is that what, I mean, you want to go record on record on that? I'm happy to do it. Like, what the fuck is he talking about? <laughs> I have no idea. Jesus Christ. But that's the last of it. Did you ever think, like, we kind of are big brother now, you know? <laughs> that's true. We're just watching ourselves. Oh, Jesus Christ. But that's more Dan, though. God. <laughs> How are things with Dan now and you? Well, they're fine. You speak I to him. Uh, yes, I spoke to him a few weeks ago. Okay, yeah, Dan's fine. Right. Why, no, well, how the hell do you know? What are you, my fucking father, Steve? <laughs> I've texted with Dan, too. I think he's Was he asking you? I wasn't asking you. I don't care. Are you and Dan? I'm well, fine. Who's you and Dan? <laughs> well, I assume if you text me, he's fine with you. How, why? What are we, fucking brothers? Uh, no, but I think I'm like a subsidiary employee of Kevin I thought, Dan. I thought he was going to say no, but I'm kind of like a son to you. I was going to say, Jesus. I well, always like, looked at you as kind of a father figure. <laughs> That's fine.